So far as this states, the nation side, the cranes from the reports that one Chris Mubiru is homosexual harassing prayers. We condemn the act, and I think this story paves way for security agencies to make thorough investigations, thorough investigations into these actions. FUFA published Rogers Mlinda says that since they assumed power in 2005, they have never associated with the person in mention and has never been accorded any role in the national team. Allegations come at a time when the cranes are preparing for the final match with the Kenya Harambe Stars. For the 24 games played, uh, six games did not have outstanding players. Our committee did not find any player worth uh, mentioning or measuring to that standard. Meanwhile, Cranes has been picked as one of the best outside team of the tournament after having five of its players nominated by the SCAFA technical team as the best outstanding so far. Among its players picked include Brian Omon who outstood on Uganda's 1-0 win over Kenya, midfielder Moses Oloya, Robert Sentongo, and Cranes captain Hassan Mwaswa. Organizers have also asked fans to keep this spin at the stadium tomorrow. We have talked about the security arrangement, which is not in our hands. It's in the hands of the Uganda security. And we have said that since this is a match involving Kenya and Uganda, you know the situation, we must beef up the security for both the teams, the players and the spectators. Sekafe General Secretary Nicholas Mothoni has thanked government for giving all the necessary support for the organizers of the tournament. The tournament final moment will kickstart with a third place playoff between Zanzibar and Tanzania at 4 p.m. before cranes lock horns with Kenya. Frank Serugo, WSTV, Kampala.